guys, today I'm going to participate in a TV tag that I found out through my friend Jody on YouTube. I will link to her channel in the description below. Basically, there are five questions and I'm going to answer them and then open it up for anybody else who wants to answer them to make their own video. So let's go. Question one. What show do you watch reruns of? That's a hard one because I don't have TV, so I watch reruns of everything. But obviously, they're looking for your favorite, and that would have to be the George Burns and Gracie Allen show. It was in the 50s, and you may not have heard of it because they don't show the reruns very often. And there was this tiny little show up against it that you may have heard of called I Love Lucy that won all the Emmys and got all the attention, and deservedly so, it was a great show. But I love Burns and Allen because it's about George Burns who plays George Burns and Gracie Allen who plays a dumbed down version of herself, a very sweet lady who misunderstands things and takes things way too literally and takes those <laughs> concepts and makes very funny things happen because of them. Definitely, it's a very sweet show. It's adorable and you'll fall in love with Gracie immediately check out the George Burns and Gracie Allen show question two is what new show do you like watching well like I said I don't have cable so I don't watch a lot of new shows until they've been out for a while but right now I'm watching Planet Earth 2 with David Attenborough which is amazing the visuals and I don't know how they get the cameras so close to these animals but you feel like you're right there and you forget that you're watching a documentary and David Attenborough's narration is exquisite so check out Planet Earth 2 definitely I don't like watching animals eat other animals and so that part I usually watch like this but other than that it's great question three is what show do you watch alone and that is all of them because um, I'm alone. Show You Wish Never Ended, that would have to be either be Friends or Will and Grace. And Will and Grace is coming back for 10 episodes, which makes me a little nervous, but I think since all the original people are gonna be there, they'll do a good job, I hope so. But I always enjoyed spending time with the cast of Friends and the cast of Will and Grace. That makes me, <laughs> that makes me sound like I was there. I wasn't there. Uh, I enjoyed watching Will and Grace and watching Friends and just the camaraderie and when you watch the, here's my theory, when you watch the bloopers of a show you can tell if the cast really gets along or not and the bloopers from those shows show that at least at the time of the filming of the show they were all great friends and that to me makes the atmosphere a lot better. So it's a tie, Friends and Will and Grace question five what show do you wish real life was like this is going to be a controversial pick but I'm going to say the Osbournes because really when you look down deep at the message of the show it's all about family and communication yes it's loud communication but like when Kelly got the tattoo and she said don't tell mom or mom which was adorable Ozzy was like well I have to because they are an open communication household for the most part anyway and they're not perfect and all that but I just felt like you know it would be nice to live in a in a big mansion with a lot of money and with you know a lot of people who have quirkiness and are artistic and well so the Osbournes controversial choice but that's what I'm picking. So now it's your turn. Go ahead and make a video and answer the five questions. And then come back and leave uh, your username in the comments so that I can go and watch your video and we can support each other, okay? Hope you're having a great day. Keep smiling. Bye.